Ciao, sono Matteo Manfredini, sono... Hi, I'm Matteo Manfredini, an Accademia Barilla chef. I'm here to show you a pasta recipe. We're going to make Barilla Ruote. We're going to make this pasta today as a traditional Calabrian recipe. Ruote with tropea onions. Calabrese, faremo le ruote con cipolla di tropea. È una ricetta... It's a savory recipe with distinctive and long-lasting flavor. A hint of sweetness from the onion and the bell pepper and traditional freshness from the basil and tomato sauce. At the end, we're going to bind the pasta using the Parmigiano Reggiano. The pasta shape that we'll be using today is rather special. It's called Barilla Ruote, pasta that binds very well with tomatoes and has a cooking time of eight minutes. Che si presta a legare molto con il pomodoro, una cottura di otto minuti. As an alternative to pasta shaped like this, I recommend Barilla Sedani. Posso consigliare i sedani Barilla. Cominciamo con. We'll start with the preparation. Let's take an onion. Una cipolla. We're going to remove the top layer, the peel. We'll cut it into strips from the round side. Let's turn on our heat. We're using 100% Italian Accademia Barilla olive oil, an oil that has body but not too much and is not too robust in flavor. We've sliced the onion like this into thin strips. This will give us a shorter, faster cooking time. I personally recommend adding the salt at the start. Salt attracts humidity. By attracting humidity, the water is released faster while keeping the onion a little more whole. Let's take the bell pepper. We're going to remove the seeds inside and dice it. I'm going to brown this onion for two minutes, but not too much. Otherwise, we'd risk burning it. We'll put in the salt. We'll drop two portions into the water. The onion still needs a few minutes to wilt. We'll raise the heat a little and add a little salt and a little pepper. If desired, the pepper skin can also be removed. 
Okay, now we'll add the tomato sauce. We'll put the basil in a few minutes before adding the pasta so that it doesn't lose too much of its essential oil and keeps its flavor more fully. I would also recommend adding a bit more before eating. Since this dish has a very intense and long-lasting flavor, I would pair it with a white wine. I would suggest a suave with a slightly bitter tang to contrast the sweetness of the pepper and onion. We'll add a small ladle of cooking water. This will make the pasta absorb more of the sauce's flavor while always keeping it al dente binding our barilla rotte well with the sauce. We'll add the basil and a little parmigiano reggiano. This dish is very aromatic, isn't it? A round of pepper with a drizzle of extra virgin olive oil enhances its aroma along with a little basil. And now, Barilla wishes you buon appetito!